I ate midweek away games. It's here. It's now. It's game day. And here we are, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages. We are back once again for your favourite TV show of the week. We are back in action on this Tuesday night. It will take us about an hour where we will be traveling down the A1 and then the M25 for this away game. We're off to Spartley's Meadow where it's London Tigers v Letchworth Garden City Eagles in the Spartans South Midlands Division 1. Here we go then. The start of a jam-packed fixture list. Saturday, Tuesday for what looks like the next two months. It's a good thing I've got a twin brother so I can rotate these games with obviously i'm the better looking one uh, i'm just a fat ugly man but anyway that's another chat in bollocks it's in football news So London Tigers finished 16th last season. They currently sit 16th after six games. We're in them last six games. They've won two and lost four. Not a clue who their manager is. This team seemed like they care more about their cricket team than their football team. This is our London Tigers stats look. I don't care about your mess. I don't give a fuck. Ah, oh, shit. Here we go again. The 13th of the 11th, 2021. London Tigers 1, Letchworth Garden City Eagles 3. So, with that all being said, let's get to the grand. Let's get some team news in. Let's get three points. And then let's... Let me get the fuck out of here. Up the eagle. <laughs> turning up now, playing against a team which will be out of shape, aggressive, and you have to go out there and do your job. But what you've shown is resilient. Winslow, battle, repeated. Resilience is a big word. So fucking don't throw that away. Go out there and fucking tonight and do the bollock, do the hard work. Business as usual. We're well, meeting in four. No way we skipped that away today. It'd be all about discipline. Previously we were playing, then they're all over the place. We can't think about what formation they're playing. We have to start sharp. They can be street footballers. They get you into a cage environment where you'll lose this game. Individually, I'm guessing they'll be quite tech, but as a team unit, they're not going to be that great. <laughs> Five two, yes? Yep. <laughs> Daniel Charles, midfield. Colin Charles, midfield. Sam James, captain. Sonny Cuffman, midfield. Mark Summers, striker. Vlad is just gone, boy. Nick Larissa, defender. Luke Schimmel, midfielder. Carl Oswald, midfielder. As you know, football isn't about ones and twos, it's about team ethos. Basic thing in this, we do not be caught out with a sticky surface and the ball being the long grass. I've been to that side of the pitch, probably as fucking fuck. These sort of games out there today put you where you need to be in the fucking league. In hard work, graph, that's all it's about. This is all about you, it's not about them beating the best in this league. So if you're beating the best, it can only be mental. So if your head's right, you've won this game. We, me and Jason don't really have to talk. It's all about you. You come here. With a quick mindset, you go out with a quick mindset, we go home with a quick mindset, we go home with three points. So let's do it and get out of it, please. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So 
so much to get this Tuesday night game underway as he plays into a door who will be looking to lift this long. We will be coming back here in a couple of weeks on another Tuesday night. Believe it or not, this is 2025, maybe even half hour into the game. Not a lot has happened by both sides. Loads of misplaced passing, loads of wayward shots as we try to control Sammy James to Trotty on the edge of the box. Instead of having a shot, he tried to play a through ball to Sonny. I'd have money, he scores on his next one. London Tigers on the counter-attack as it's five Letchworth defenders against three London Tiger players. He's got two options. He's decided to go for the shot and that'll be the first shot on target about half hour in. Richard looking to play the ball into the box. Doesn't meet the first man. Sammy with a shot. <laughs> Sonny looking to get with a follow-up. Managed to be cleared away by London Tigers. Sonny the square, this is a trotty. First time shot. And it's in the back of the net. The keeper's fumbled it. He's pushed it into his own net. It's butterfingers. I hope he don't drop the soap like he's just dropped that ball. Not a clue what the London Tigers are moaning at the ref for. Sonny's been put through one-on-one -on -one with a keeper. He's got his shot off, but the keeper's pulled off that save. That's a corner. Game's decided to liven up a bit as this corner will be played in by Sammy James. Tigers will get this ball away. Semi. As the London Tigers players dancing on the ball, he's got four or five of his own players in front of him, but decides to throw himself on the floor. Free kick to Letchworth as Sammy James the players all the way to the back post where Summers is creeping. He's played across the goal line. It's 2 0. Sonny, who was unmarked, has knocked that in. 2 0. Sammy James has enjoyed that one. Tigers have got their work cut out for him. They can't believe it. We are 2 0 up. Give us the lead. Danny with the ball. Plays it up to Summers who with the flick onto Sonny, who is unmarked. First time shine is 3 0. <laughs> Oh no, it's been ruled out for offside. Sonny wasn't off, maybe Summers was, hard to tell. Tigers with possession as they play a little 1-2 between 11 and 7 as 11 looks across this ball in. They're trying to claim a penalty. They're saying no. Referee's saying get on with it. Slabhead let his man run. He's switched off there as Nath will play the ball out to Slabhead. And we will look to carry this. Slabhead into Danny. Danny into Trotty. Trotty into Richard, total football's back once again ladies and gentlemen as Richard will burn that pace, the most handsome man in football, looks across the ball, it's, oh, it's top of the goal, did he fancy that one from there? Tigers, it's a long range effort, was that a cross or a shot? Either way, that's held by Nathan who will roll this out to Slabhead. Slabhead into Trotty, Trotty first time pass into Richard, Richard with the burners again, driving down this side, half for Sonny, Sonny into Danny, oh it's total football, look at this sexy football, well that wasn't fucking sexy was it, remember when you was in year 11 at school and you got year 7 football and just decided to boat it because you thought fuck it I can, that's what happened right there, and that would be half time as the referee calls it, London Tigers nil, Electric Garden City Eagles 2, it's really important to take the feedback on board for me, we start with end of the mid block, you know how frustrating it is, we don't have to rush our passing, three, three times in the first 15 minutes, giving the ball away. Now they've gone to a high press, we turn them. And what happens is you're getting in. Honestly, from everybody, do you think that first half was good enough? I'm slightly go off what Jason said. When they do mid blocks, the ball has to zip and move quickly. Because once you take your time, their shuffle is hard to get through. Brilliant defender. Ain't got much negative to say about it, but you need to work on your passing. So now, if you need to work on your passing, you have to shorten it. Keep it short, keep it short. And as time progresses, then you can lengthen your pass. You're looking for really good passes. You've seen it, but at the moment, you just can't deliver it. Which means we're on the defence. First half, they, they've gone in the mid block, they've all shuffled across. Hate to zone three or four times. You've taken a touch, taken a touch, taken a touch. He's closed down, he has to go out the other side. It's just bang, put it in. At the moment, the goals have disrupted them. They've conceded and what's happened to their discipline? Absolutely shot. Now they've moved to two up front. The manager has not told them to do that. So he told you what kind of players we're playing against. If you give them a sniff, you're going to have a battle on your hands this second half. Why are we going to go 60, 70 yard passes when they're easy passes on? Take the wind out of their sails. Guess why? By keeping the ball. Win the game. Second part, keep a nil-nil. <coughs> we'll get the third goal. It doesn't yeah, matter. Yeah. We, get, we don't need the third goal. We need to manage this game. The rest is up to you. Just go and finish the job. Please do not relax. We ain't won nothing yet. Three points, please, Come on. Come on. Come on. And London Tigers will get this second half underway. They have made three changes. Let's see if it makes a difference. Pinned back already. Tigers making advances towards the box. Ball played in. Slabhead with a clearance. We're not quick enough to get out to close this down as we are literally pinned back into our own box. Ball played in. Most handsome man in the world with a semi-clearance. 
Number seven to pick this up and play a little chip and that will go out for a goal kick. Corner to line the Tigers. As the big man at the back's waiting, Dempsey's nowhere near him. Are they going to play this ball in or what? The ball's gone over and he's met the big man. Dempsey has not jumped with his man and they've pulled one back. It's 2-1. Everyone's in a state of shock. No one knows what's going on. Poor man marking once again and we've allowed them into the game. Well that goal's definitely gave them a bit of a confidence boost as their tails are up and they are trying to find the equaliser as Dempsey cuts that ball out there. Number 10 are marked. Again we are ball watching. A little dancing in the box. Ball in. Nothing that Nathan can't deal with. But at the moment we are far too busy ball watching. Another corner to Tigers as now Slavid will try and mark the goal scorer number 14. Even he can't deal with him. Ball played in away from Sammy. We are so congested in our own box. We still cannot clear it. I don't even think we've been in their half at the moment. And we're only about 10 minutes into this second half. So them subs or whatever was said at half time in that changing room has definitely done something. A rocket up their arse. Ball finally played in. Nathan will take the sting out of it. At the moment it's one way traffic as London Tigers are driving into that box. Had a shot away. Nathan's held. Cannot touch him, otherwise he goes down as a pen. And we have finally somehow managed to get into their half as Schimmel will line up this free kick and he's only gone and rattled the bar. Ah, oh, That's how our luck has gone so far this half. And as the subs ask me while watching in anticipation how long is left, there are sponsors available, people. If you want to sponsor these Spice Boys in pink bibs and the sub who has scored the goal to bring them back is only gone and got himself a 10-minute sim bin. Carlos giving it the old you give too much math mate and now you go and get in a sim bin. Ref surely that's kicking the ball away. Even though it's thrown an armband. We'll still take it. Free kick to London Tigers as we are heading into the last five minutes. A bit nervy as they win the flick on. Slabhead doesn't get full connection onto that. London Tigers looking to break in. They're trying to claim our ball but Flavi has knocked it long to Alexander Kleb. Sonny the most skillfulest man in football. Cuts inside. Plays that ball over into the path of Rusev, he's got Dempsey to the left, Rusev has been cut out, Carlos will collect the ball, play it into H, H will play that back, we will control this play right now, Carlos with a lovely little turn, play it into Schimmel, Schimmel with a ball over the top, into the path of Flav, Flav looking to beat his man, goes to the byline, he does get a cross in, the keepers dropped that one. There is only a matter of seconds remaining as Tigers are desperately looking to get this equaliser. The ball is played in. Away by Dempsey. Max with the half clearance and a referee will blow up there. Full time. London Tigers 1. Let's with Garden City Eagles 2. Before we went out, I said to you, the last words, do not get in an arm wrestle with it. Three points, it's done. Wipe the floor now. Finish. Don't talk. But you work hard. You don't go down to their level. You've worked hard and got results. It's moments of the game. I'm not going to do yeah. that. I'm comfortable with three points. He'll tell me exactly what's gone fucking wrong. I'm the invisible man. As a complete unit, well done. Couple of things we need to address. Dempsey, discipline to position. We're winning 2 1. Why are you attacking their box? Makes no sense. And that's where you, with all the experience that you got, was to drag him back to keep position so that we win this game. If you're away, when you come back to football, it doesn't matter how well you think you play, you can't expect to come and start. Because while you've been away, holiday, girlfriend's birthday, your birthday, whatever it may be, while you're away having fun, the rest of the team are busting their ass to play. So now, if you come back, we have to drop somebody who's been busting their ass while you've been enjoying yourself. It makes no sense. Semi-professional football, we expect a certain amount of dedication. With every action becomes a react. You want to go on holiday and have a nice time, that's fine. You're, the reaction of that is, you have to fight for your spot, whether you started or not. Let's think about this. Do not be selfish for other people's time. That needs to be addressed. So that if you're on the bench, when you come here, fucking be professional. That's what I'm asking. But ultimately, you've got another win. It doesn't matter how you do it, you've got another win. And that's the bottom line. So we're going to come in first day. We're going Saturday. Well done, Jerry. Well done, boys. Well done, boys. So Richard, another win for the boys today, a 2-1 victory against London Tigers. How do you think you played? How do you think the boys played? I think they've done all right. I was pretty aggressive in the first half, just a bit disappointing in the final third. The boys were pretty decent in the first half, got a couple of goals. Just a bit of a shame that we uh, didn't push on and get the third goal. Second half, very frustrating. Fair play to London Tigers, they come out really put a lot of pressure on us and we really struggled to get out, get our own half and create many chances. We defended well and uh, got the three points. On to the next one. Let's go. So the game finished, London Tigers 
Tigers 1, Letrith Garden City Eagles 2. Bit of a nervy second half. The boys battled well and we deserved the win overall. So you guys know what to do. Like, share, subscribe, do all of that. Get it out there. I've got dogs to feed and bills to pay. Come on, people. Help me out here. You know what to do. ta -la. Richard, sing them out. Down, we're gonna run.